Good day, STS users around the world. There appears to be some misunderstanding regarding the base date and the key revision number, KRN, of vending keys. The misconception is that for any 2014 base date vending key, the KRN will be KRN2. The KRN is simply a one-digit number indicating the revision of a vending key for a particular supply group code and is in no way linked to the base date of that vending key. A new revision of a vending key may be requested for other reasons outside of implementing an updated base date. It is possible to have a vending key on base date 2014 with a KRN of 1 if it is the first vending key to be issued for that supply group code. It just so happens that most current vending keys that are on the 1993 base date have a KRN of 1. And when you request a new revision of those vending keys for a 2014 base date, the KRN will be incremented to KRN2. However, if a 1993 base date vending key already has a KRN2, then when a new revision of this vending key is requested for a 2014 base date, the KRN will be incremented to KRN3. In summary, a new vending key for an SGC can be requested for reasons other than a base date change. And whenever this request is made, the current KRN will be incremented. There is therefore no direct link between the base date and the KRN. Thank you very much.